What's up guys? This episode of the More Better Podcast is made possible to you by Bipti Design. Bipti Design is an interior design company that believes your home should be a reflection of your unique style and personality. Their team of experienced interior designers work closely with you to create a space that is not only stunning, but functional. Did I say sexy? That too. They also have an eye for detail and a passion for creating beautiful spaces, unlike Kam's house, which is raggedy as hell. From stylish living rooms to chic kitchens, which Kam doesn't know because his kitchen is dank, Mm. right? They transform your house into a home you love coming back to. But that's not all. Mm-hmm. With Bipti Design, your dream home is only a few steps away. They offer a wide range of services including furniture selection, colour consultation, lighting solutions and much more. Their team is dedicated to providing exceptional quality and personalised service because they know every client is unique and they would tailor every single detail to meet your specific needs and budget. Boom! Call Bipti Design now at 887-52611 and use promo code MOREBETTER at Bipti for a $500 discount wow. for packages. $500 eh, okay? They can also schedule a free consultation and let them transform your home into a space you'll be proud to show off. That's 887-52611 and use promo code MOREBETTER at Bipti for $500 off at Bipti Design. 500? Where, yes. 500? You know. 500. Where comfort and creativity meets Functionality. There's the song, okay? Na, 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 that's, that's what we're going with. You use na, that. Na, 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 <laughs> <laughs> the More Better Podcast. <laughs> So what's Chef Bob's age? No, no, I'm loading uh, Sassy Mama SG. Why are you loading Why Sassy Mama Because it doesn't have the Google info. Sassy Mama is actually a, a popular blogger in Singapore. Yeah. Okay. He, okay. She, she's writing about how he lost okay. 95 How kg. old is Chef Bob and how and, and is, is my age, between my age and Chef Bob, is our gap bigger than your age to mine? I don't know where Chef Bob's age is at, bro. See, Chef Bob never releases his release age. Yeah. I'm telling you, man, it's a different Chef Bob, dude. Yeah, I I'm think so too. They replace Chef Bob with, with another Chef Bob. Yeah. I'm telling you, for yeah. real. Yeah. For real. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back Rocker. to the More Better Podcast. Chef Bob, let us know your age, uh, Chef Bob. Chef Bob, I... if you're listening, please tell us who replaced you and how do we get in touch yeah. with them? Because um, this is a lizard Chef Bob now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, uh, guys, uh, we don't have dates yet, but uh, the Malacca show is coming soon. We are in the works right now. We have already booked the theater and uh, we are now uh, focusing on the date. I just want to tell you that it's in November. That's when wow. the date is. We just don't have a confirmed date in November. I might or might not be wearing my birthday jersey. So if you what? want to find out oh. about that, you have to come down to uh, uh, wherever the location is. Once I have the poster, I'll just check my s- Instagram for details. That's so you book the theatre for a range of dates, is it? No, I booked, the, I, I, I booked <laughs> it already. I just I just uh, forgot to ask them uh, if it's confirmed or not on the date. Oh, so okay. I, cannot really, I cannot really tell them that. Okay. But then again, okay. uh, thank you guys. Thank you guys for all the support for the Malaysian tour. And nice. uh, Malacca, you guys are the last stop. So I can't wait to uh, come home. Mm. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. So, guys, there'll be a homecoming for you. I have, I have shows in October. Uh, on the seventeenth of October, I'm headlining Comedy Masala. Ooh. Boom! Yeah, classic. Uh, yeah, get your tickets from ComedyMasala.com. And then one week after that, on the twenty eighth, I'm headlining at the Lemon Stand on a Saturday. Mm. Explain so, the Lemon Stand to the audience, man. The Lemon Stand is Singapore's only. A uh, comedy club right full-time now. Full time comedy club. Well, it's not really full time because there are no shows on Wednesdays. <laughs> hey, God! Yesterday got Kuma show. All oh, right. Well, yeah. mm. it's it's a purpose built comedy club. Yeah. I, I think it's the, mm. the best we can describe it. Mm. So yeah, I'm headlining there, and then uh, uh, I guess before that actually, the the last week of October on the twenty sixth, Jackie and Friends is coming back. We're oh, gonna ooh. be at Park Provisions. Yeah. Park Provisions is uh moving. So that's technically the last show at Park Provisions. It's the last show at that Park Provisions. Uh. Mm. And if you go there and you guys can still... I don't know if they can still order stuff when they're there because... Uh, during Coffee show, is dope, right? Yeah, no, I'm just going to say the latte is pretty fire. Coffee, the yeah. Latte is fire. And they got vegan... Uh, vegan know, bites. Vegan stuff. Vegan bites. Yeah, so if you're vegan... You know, you, know, you don't have to be vegan to be eat vegan, vegan no, food. no, no, no. I'm just saying on top of being gay, you can also... Uh, you know, yeah. yeah, you can also if, enjoy... If uh, only meat that you consume, you should go to get it's, vegan food. You know what? Right? Actually, sure, you it's can. discrimination free because uh. like, we don't discriminate. Like, not that there's anything wrong with being... Discrimination? Not that there's anything wrong There's nothing wrong, wrong with, with being discrimination. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's not that there's anything wrong with discrimination. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, <laughs> it's uh-huh. just that you can get vegan bites there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah provisions provisions yeah. Yeah. And also don't... enjoy a great comedy show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, tickets for that is out and you can get them from the Telegram chat if you want. So... 
go to Telegram, you type in Jackie and Friends. There's yes. a group. Yes. There's like a mm. the channel there and yeah. then you can get tickets from there. Yeah. That's also where Jackie has his monthly worships if you want to, ah, you know, yeah. if you want. On live stream. On, yeah, because yeah. because Jackie is... is a cult leader. Yeah, he's, he's yeah, yeah, moving yeah, yeah. The, towards that direction. So if you <clears> want to join the Telegram group, please know that you're signing your life. Mm. To yeah. the dedication of Jackie Ng Comedy. Telegram is the social media of choice for cult leaders. Mm. Yeah. I think now, probably. Yeah. Probably. What's yeah, that? Uh, you think the Jones, uh, what, the Jones Massacre? What, the Jonas Massacre? The, jo- the Jones Massacre? Was <laughs> the Jonas Massacre was no, your no, first concert. No, 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 the Jonas, <laughs> Jonas, Jonas Brothers. Brothers uh. The Jones <laughs> Massacre, is it? Wait, wait, Jones There's a lot of massacres in America, Jones, la, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, uh, yeah, Jones Massacre. Yeah. The, the Jones Massacre. Jones Town Massacre. Jones Town right. Massacre. You think yeah. those guys would have uh, nah, been Nah, I don't think they needed a telegram because that was pretty hyper-localized to Jonestown. Yeah. So you could that's just spread the message there. there. No, they moved to Jonestown. They moved to Jonestown and that's and where they Yeah, yeah. So all of them are already there. So they don't need Telegram. <laughs> that's, yeah. true. That's, <laughs> true. that's true. That's true. They know where to go. Yeah. yeah. They're already yeah. There. If you're not farming, yeah. you're worshipping yeah. Jones. My, well, the my cult <laughs> <laughs> uh, is not planning for a murder anytime soon. Okay. So okay. there will okay. still be a bunch of shows to enjoy okay. before the yeah. aforementioned you know what? murder ne- never, is never. You, no, you will, you will ne- never you, you will never the murder you will yeah. never murder well we, I, I, I just don't want to be sure yeah. <laughs> yeah. he doesn't want to limit his cult yeah, I don't it can be anything cult. they want to be yeah yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. but I mean, there will be shows before that la. Yeah. okay okay yeah. are you running a cult anytime soon uh, no la. then what, <laughs> what, what, what do you have to announce uh, nothing la. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say I was going to announce anything <laughs> right ladies right. and gentlemen welcome back to the more better podcast just like old times yeah it's just the three of us today and we are just hanging out and of course uh, I think a lot of things yeah. are, are happening in Singapore the new right. Lee Kuan Yew documentary is out Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, the Lee Kuan Yew docu- documentary is is, is uh, I would just say fire yeah. there are two fire. there are two right oh, yeah, yeah. so watch the, the the better one is in his own words in his right. own words. Yeah, so there's one that people is people's words about him yeah, yeah, yeah. and yeah. then the second one is his, own, his words. own words yeah. one so of them all is, his speeches dude. Right. it's insane yeah one of them is uh, I heard he say uh, I don't <laughs> know yeah, he yeah. say one now but the other one is he really say one in his own words yeah that's the one right yeah Mm. My my TikTok FYP is filled with uh Lee Kuan Yew speeches now. Wow, you're so lucky, dude. I I mean I'm, I I just use it use the app responsibly and the app rewards me accordingly, lah. Right. Mm. So now I think there's one account. It's called the Lee Kuan Yew Coin, <laughs> like because they just released the Lee Kuan Yew Coin. Yeah. And so someone created the account. The display picture is the coin, and it uploads the speeches, speeches. of Lee Kuan Yew. Didn't yeah. they try and pay for something with the Lee Kuan Yew coin? Like, didn't yeah. somebody go to a shop and try to pay for bubble tea with the Lee Kuan Yew coin? Yeah, or yeah, yeah. And yeah. then people panic. People are like, what's this? What's this? What's this? <laughs> this is they, worth more than you can ever imagine. It's 10 bucks. It's 10, <laughs> it's not, it's 10 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> it could be bro, anything. You want to kiss Lee Kuan Yew's ass also yeah. not that no, hard. Bro. Bro. Nah, bro. Oh my Lee Kuan Yew. If bro. you got the coin, right, you uh, would genuinely feel... I would buy a pack of cigarettes. <laughs> Did you apply for the coin? Nah, nah, nah. Did you apply for the coin? I applied for the coin, but yeah. I didn't get it. Did you get it? I didn't get it. What what, what do you qualify to get? Uh, what can, what can you do to qualify I mean, for the coin for the coin? If you qualify, then you can you get to go and buy the coin, lah. Yeah. For ten dollars, ah, right? For ten dollars, you get. I think everyone is allowed a maximum of four if you qualify. Is mm-hmm. there like a series of like different poses or something, or is it no, all I don't the same think so. I think it's all the same coin. But then right. you qualify for four to get four of the same you, you coin. Can, yeah, right. like, it's for collectors, ah, ma. Right. Yeah. And a lot is happening, uh, because uh, taxi uncles finally snap, mm-hmm. and I think it's not. Uh, to be to be fair. I don't wanna. I wanna say it's a Tara uncle. <laughs> it's a Tara uncle. Tara, it's a Tara. It's, it's not, not a taxi uncle. Okay, so it's an yeah. uncle that was driving. Yeah. Had nothing to do with uh all the other apps. Yeah. Actually, okay. One. Uh, let's say if I'm a driver, right? Yeah. I can sign up for more than Grab, right? I can, yeah, I can yeah, be yeah. a Grab driver. I can be a Tara driver. Yeah, I, can yeah. be, I can be a Gojek driver. Can open all. So technically, I'm just a taxi. No, you're, you're, uh, no. What's the What's the word called? Like Grab, they have. I know. Uh, right human share. Courier. A right, no, not right, share. right share uh, driver. No, I mean yeah, there, there is like there's a sticker there now, right? Like yeah. private hire, private hire, private hire, private hire driver. Private hire driver. Okay, yeah. so you're private hire driver. So we should just label them as private hire drivers. Yeah, uh-huh. right. Uh, and I think most of the time the uncles they mm. talk a lot, right? So uncles yeah. like to talk a lot okay, yeah. when you drive it. Annoying. Okay, annoying. So that's why that's why in Singapore if you ride Grab you can opt for quiet ride. Mm. You can opt for quiet. Is that only a Grab thing? It, yeah, or, or it's a grab thing. Grab it's not, ocean, it's not yeah. just in Singapore. Air, mm. Malaysia, Thailand, yeah. everywhere has the quiet mode. Okay, la. so you have travel Southeast Asia. Yeah. It's whether or not the driver respects the quiet mode. Because sometimes you can turn on quiet mode. Mm-hmm. In Singapore especially, mm-hmm. um, they will still talk to you. Right. <laughs> You're right. in their car. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Can yeah. yeah. so, complain, right? So yeah. a lot of times, you can opt for quiet mode. So mm. I think if you did opt for quiet mode, then in the driver talks to you, then you have more of a leverage to say like, hello, I didn't even want to talk to yeah. this guy in right. the first place. I turn on, However... Yeah. 
I think in our culture, it's not unfamiliar for the driver to, to be talking, talking to you. Talk, ah, yeah. 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 And when they talk to you, man, they be saying some wild shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They be saying some wild ass shit. Yeah. Uh, for example, uh, come give some examples. <laughs> <laughs> there was once I took a grab and this driver the whole time was uh, mm. telling me the problem with women. Wow! Whoa, whoa, yeah. whoa, whoa! I and think he just had a like fight with his wife or right, girlfriend right, right. or whatever. Can, 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 can yeah. you repeat? Like, can, can, can okay. you? Can so this you, one, I entered, I entered, uh, I entered the grab and like I just said, oh hello. Yeah. And, like, I just put my earpiece. These are the and words of the grab driver. No, no, I said hello to the grab. You said hello to the grab driver. Just like being nice. Like, I entered okay, his okay, car. Okay, okay, I said hello. I said hi. And I put my earpiece on. Mm-hmm. Then he, 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 I, I hear him talking. Mm-hmm. And like, I thought, like, oh maybe he's talking to me. So I took off the earpiece. Mm-hmm. And he said, like, oh before this, uh, got a female passenger. Damn. Right. And then like, yeah, and what? Like, mm. I, I don't want to talk. Uh. I didn't say that, but like, yes. my mom, I don't want to talk. Yeah. And he just started telling me like, you know, like this woman wanted him to go here, but then she typed the, the wrong address in, mm. but then like, please send me there because like, it's dangerous for me to be here. Like, and that's the problem with women, uh, you know? Like, they, they, they think what all men want to hurt them, is it? <laughs> like, she like that. And I'm like, yo, I am not going to join in this com- like right. like, what okay, did okay. he expect out of that he yeah. wanted me to go like yeah la, you know all these yeah women, because la. I, I feel like maybe because their grab driver is he watches this show and <laughs> no, he's no, like no, no. hey this is, a, this is a guy that hates women coming into <laughs> my car no. right now this is he's, way, my, he's this my favorite before. character he's my favorite character yeah, I got you right. I got you this way before bro <laughs> oh, way before. this is when he was skinny oh, this was, oh, right. when was that no this in the army no no this was a couple of like maybe last like two years ago two years ago two years a year and a half ago Yeah. okay so he wanted you to Join in in his misogynistic yeah. rant. Right. So his misogynistic rant was women. Okay, but I'm not gonna lie. I like chocho him a bit. The fuck you. What do you say? I like kept like say how yeah, far you go. Right. Yeah. You, <laughs> how far you agree, la, Right. You like. No. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. I, I never agreed. I never oh, agreed. Okay. Then how, I, do you, how do you chocho him? I went like, uh, yeah, la, I mean, you key in the wrong address already. Then you don't expect to go to another place, why? Right? Then the price will be different. Yeah. Wow. Right? You fucking bastard. Yeah. No lah. <laughs> No, be- is it because you wanted acceptance from this uncle? A little a bit, a bit. Yeah, right, as yeah, a, that, that, I mean, yeah, la, yeah, la, it's a dad thing. Yeah, it's a dad yeah. thing. Let's wow, talk okay. Let's it's not, not all a dad thing. thing. I mean, it could be, you know, it, it could, could be. be. Because it's an yeah, old yeah, uncle yeah, yeah, yeah. talking to you and he approving your no, presence. He didn't, look, he didn't look old. He was like maybe like late 30s. Oh, so look yeah, like fast. Yeah, that's not old. That's not old. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, for me, I guess that was old. No, 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 no. I was like 28. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then... Bro, when I got out the uh, grab, like, you reached, I think it was going to your place, right? Yeah. So, at the roundabout, he dropped me off. Then I'm going out, and then he, like, he gave me this look of, like, thanks for listening, man. He, like, <laughs> have a nice day. And I'm, like, aww. Right. And I walk away. Right. Then the door closed, like, oh, what a fucking misogynist. And I walk away. So, that's, okay, misogyny, right? So, mine is different. Mine is, uh, uh, I got into the grab. So, this was at, I think, around um, Labrador Park there. So, mm. I was at Labrador Park. I was just chilling at Labrador Park. And then I, I, I call a grab. I was chilling, I was having a picnic with one of my friends, I think. The, the barbecue, the barbecue. Right. So right after I'm done, it's useless information, but after I'm done, right, I called him, came in, this whole, this whole taxi stank, stank of some porna. Like, 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 oh. like crack, 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 okay, so you were like, so you might, you, you know, you must think like, wow, this guy must have had a smoke before and I was a smoker back then, so I thought like, okay lah, you know, yeah. maybe, that's fine, right? You know, yeah. maybe you went for a smoke before this, I'm pretty sure it's a long day. Right, I'm not gonna mention the race of, of this uh, taxi driver because I think it's unnecessary. Of course, to the yeah. story is completely unnecessary yeah. to the story. Yeah, yeah. But as he was driving, he was like, "Ayah, nowadays, uh, tell you, uh, mm. okay, mm-hmm. nowadays, uh, mm. okay, very tiring. Mm. All this, all this work, twelve hours, very tiring. Mm. You know, sometimes uh, you just need one balance uh, to relax the mind. Yeah, huh? That's why you must relax the mind. Uh, one, one balance." Uh, Again, yeah. okay, again. I'm and then saying, you pull out the barons no, for no, him. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's bad. So I was nervous. I was like, what do you mean? What do you, what do you mean? Uncle? Just now I went, la. I went, la. I went to the corner for a cigarette. La. You know, and I just need a barons. I just relax the mind. La. Relax the mind. La. Yeah. So I'm on a barons now la, to relax the mind. I'm like, okay, shit. He's been drinking. Yeah. He had a beer. Yeah, right. he had a beer. And um, was it, it, was a a, it was a surprisingly safer drive. Uh, yeah, so yeah. actually, this is what I learned in Vietnam. They were telling me that when you call a grab bike at night, you you want a old drunk man? <laughs> Why? Because the old man they work the whole fucking day. They and when they drink, it's really for them to relax. And because wait wait don't don't say it like that. Say like how like like no, but this, is this, this is in Vietnam. Oh, okay, okay, right. Okay, it's for okay, them okay. to relax. How would they say relax the mind in Vietnam? We we relax our mind. <laughs> they don't that's 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 how that's what they do, right? <laughs> and because they know that they have drunk, they drive slower and therefore safer. 
what you don't want is a, a, a hungry young go-getter mm. that wants to get as many trips as possible in a day. Yeah. They will be speeding even though they never drink. That's true. This yeah. uncle wasn't speeding. He did fall asleep at the light though. Wow. Okay. Light, light, yeah, light, yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. he fell asleep. That is the legal nap zone for no. <laughs> And I swear the whole ride, this guy was... <laughs> I swear for the whole ride... And so the whole right, this guy was like kind of half asleep, half oh, awake. Right. So he was like that. Mm. And I think this is a very comfortable position for right. like fat people. I don't know if that's true. I mean, like, correct me if I'm wrong. No, I was like know. that. Like he's resting his head on all the cushion that he has accumulated over the years, right? So he's mm. resting his head. And then he's just breathing that very, like that, that fat man breath. You know? <laughs> <laughs> uh, just uh, okay, uh, relax. Uh, just relax the mind. <sighs> and then he stopped and he's still breathing. But you can't tell whether or not he's snoring or breathing. Right. Right? And then he stayed at the light there. And then when the light turned green, he continued. <laughs> and I was like, Uncle, oh. Then he continued. He drive. Wow. So he was snoring. Uh, right. So he was snoring. Uh, so he was yeah. completely asleep. He was, um, I think he tapped REM already. Ah, uh, right. He okay. was dreaming already. He was already dreaming. But he was, right. yeah. But, but, but I think that alone was a safer ride than a lot of the... Yeah, than that people that would speed like a, a lot, madman, right? Yeah, a lot of the Chinese uncles that... that okay, now you know he's not Chinese. So, so yeah, you yeah, narrow yeah. down to the... No, we knew we already knew when you opened your mouth yeah. earlier. No, 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 but like you don't know, you know? Yeah, we, no, we do, know, though. We know. You, don't, you don't know. We, like, we do, what, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's very obvious. You assume, your accent... Yeah. Your accent work is so accurate it, that we know. Nah. It's so limited that we know... <laughs> with, it could only be like three races. So what if his name was Faisal? Huh? Yeah, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter what his name is. We heard yeah. his accent. Actually, if his name was Faisal, still can be, still can. Okay, be no, anything. actually, no. I give you uh, credit. You have a range of four, lah. Right, okay. you got the Chinese, uh -huh. the Filipino, uh -huh. the Indian, and yeah. the Malay. Yeah, yeah, that's your range. So it could be yeah. at least four, and like you take out the Malay already, because your Malay always got the A. Yeah, and it starts with already. A. Yeah, it starts <laughs> with A. Anyway, it's not already. I don't know. Uh, if it's Malaysian, it's way. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's pretty much the same. Yeah. Way is not. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> way. Way is pretty Malaysian. Yeah. Yeah. Way is pretty Malaysian. Yeah. What about you, man? Do you have one any? time? Yeah. I got in, like this is. I guess it's back now. Grab share. Uh. So so like you, they pick up different people along the way. Mm. Uh, I got in the car. Went to pick up a couple. This couple came in. Both of them smell like sweat. Right. Terrib like very Ooh. smelly. And Wait, then, so is the race important to this um, story? Well, no, it's just for accuracy's sake. I guess it's just uh. part of the story, lah, right? Okay. Uh, Chinese couple came in. Both of them were... They smell like sweat. It was terrible. Uh, Wait, I, didn't, I didn't know you mentioned Chinese before. Right? Okay, yeah, I did. Uh, and then we... We just kept quiet throughout the, Because you're trying to partly hold your uh. breath also. Mm. And then wait, when, wait, I was the layout of the seating. Where were you sitting? So I sit at the back behind, uh, the driver, and then the couple came in. So the girl sat, um, passenger seat, and then the guy sat at the, the, the front. It's like oh, Matt right. B O, uh, like Matt B O, Matt B O. Yeah. Uh, and then, uh, the driver was like, "Wow, what y'all do, ah?" Uh? <laughs> <laughs> well, he called it out, uh. <laughs> yeah. And then the, the 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 couple said that they were renovating a flat, mm. and then they were like, oh. oh no wonder la. Because but he, how, he never said they sweating when they, they they renovate a flat. Like how how like I suppose they, they are doing like they are doing the labor. Yeah, that means they are doing the labor. Right. That right. is that is my guess or what. Where did, where, where do you pick them up from? This was like Queenstown area, I think. Nah, Queenstown. Yeah, like on the way back, of course. Right. Uh, and, then, be the area, and then the moment the, the two of them alighted, the, the driver literally turned to me like, wah, chi bai kam hot chao. I'm assuming they were fucking smelly. Fucking smelly. Uh, wow, Chiba come hot chow. Then I'm like, yeah, yeah. Then he just, then he took out the, I mean like, he do all of this after they alighted, right? Mm -hmm. Which I, I have half yeah. respect for, but he took out the air, air freshener. Yeah. Chiba, I almost took out spray them. So can't now. I'm like, yeah, you say this now, but you were very civil when they were in the car. You know what I mean? <laughs> I mean he doesn't want to kenal like the uncle, bro. Of course, the uncle uh, went, first. bro, he went ham, bro. That uncle went ham. That, one, that uncle was just like, he snapped at one point. Like yeah. at first, he was just Wait, like. The, 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 it's right before he U-turn. I, yeah. <laughs> I remember the scene vividly. He walked to U-turn and he just turned and just fucking yelling. No, because yeah. at first he was like, "Your child is one three five and then the lady. Yeah, what was like, that about? Is there a height limit? Is so it, is that the height so, you need a child seat if you yeah. if you have a child. You need to book a car with a child seat. So that's a bit more expensive, oh. and some people will save money by. Not booking a child seat, so they just hold their child or whatever. I mean, they would or just put them in a in a in a regular in a, seat, yeah. yeah. 
So he said, your child is 135. But I don't know how you would know if a child is 135. Like, uh. I guess by just looking. Maybe uh. he knows like the height of the car and where mm, the child mm. is relative to it. Maybe. Yeah. So then, then then he's just like, your child is 135. And then he goes like, nah, my child is 137. He's nine years old. And then I don't know from where mm. this guy just like, okay, lost his point already. Yeah. He just goes, but then. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I feel like maybe in his head, yeah. the that was his trump card that you brought in a fucking child into my car that yeah. is illegal I have that over you yeah. uh-huh. but then when that was like dispelled like when he heard 137 like yeah. bang the plan is gone yeah. and then yeah. he just yeah. went straight to hellfire right yeah yeah he went to be like I am Chinese <laughs> I am Chinese you are you Indian are, you listen he, he to me he never said you are Indian he said you are India I think somehow that's worse yeah. Like, like, yeah. 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 you are the country yeah you yeah. are India yeah, and you I went am, to the moon. Yeah. I, <laughs> I am the people. best. I am the best. And you guys are the very, 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 very worst. Worst his words. Did he say that? I think he said he that. He said very, very, very worst. Yeah. Shit. Oh, really? He did that? Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. I can't I, quote him. No, he said you are the worst customer ever. That's what he said. Right. He said you are the worst. You no, know, you said you're the worst customer. I think he, what he meant to say the was Indians are, the, Indians worst are the worst customers ever. Yeah. Well, they're not the easiest. Yeah. You know what I mean? But then they're not the worst. Yeah, yeah I mean, right. you you have difficult ra- uh, customers of every race. Every race, yeah. Right. Yeah. Right, yeah. Uh, yeah, I guess so. But you Confirm. Know, yeah. When, when people make, like, once they hit a certain tax bracket, they just think they're allowed to be an asshole, lah, right? And, yeah. And then yeah. you, you, you will feel But then you still take grab, bro. You, you know what I mean? You take, take grab. So, like, you can't, how, how high right. of a tax bracket do you belong to if you still want to, like, Grab, mm, you know I mean, mean Grab is very expensive though yeah, yeah It's damn expensive It's yeah. not even Grab It's Tada It's cheaper than Grab Oh yeah, yeah It's Tada yeah. right So yeah. so, so I, I said, like, when, when that happened I was thinking right Like what if Tada just hired All the racist drivers And that's their sh- And that's their thing Like it's marketing. our driver racist But cheaper No ah. <laughs> Right would you like, Do you miss old Singapore like, Yeah <laughs> That's Would you, story. yeah, like, like travel in, back in time in Tada? No, I mean, I, I think to a lot of people, as long as it's cheaper, it's worth the. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, if I got to go home and the a taxi I ride just is put on earpiece. Yeah, if a taxi ride is like thirty five bucks and yeah. I save five dollars, then yeah, can you offer me a quiet ride on Tada? Not right uh, now. Not right now. Yeah. Tada one option I, is uh, racist or non racist. <laughs> that would be the Tada's <laughs> option. <laughs> <laughs> she put she she she, she keyed in on non applicable. <laughs> so it's like she rolled the dice on that one, right? Yeah. yeah. Hello, auntie. You didn't click the non racist top. Yeah. Right? Hello. Hello. Yeah. You never yeah. made option. Yeah. 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 And she was like, "I'm Eurasian. I'm not." And and when she said, "I'm Eurasian," I'm not gonna lie. I heard it. You I heard, heard it. I heard it in the voice. In a, the Eura- like, like a, she has a Eurasian twang. Right. 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 That's of course. A little not, bit yeah, of, yeah. A, of a of a prestigious uh, vo- like. Yeah, yeah, like, like a bit of like a like a she thought she was also a gold medalist coming yeah. out of her was it? <laughs> no, you Actually, know, you, I you don't know. think I don't think Joseph Schooling you know the sounds voice? like a Eurasian, right? But Joseph right. Schooling's face is the first thing you see when you enter the Eurasian um, embassy, or not or embassy, embassy uh, center. Or the the yeah. they yeah. they have a museum inside there, the heri- the the Eurasian Heritage Center. Uh, There's a heritage? museum up there. Is it heritage? It, or? It's in Juchet. Mm, right that place mm, mm. and when you enter the museum on the top floor the first face you see is Joseph Schooling yeah yeah. so yeah. I like when, when she said that she claimed like I think when she said that all the all the, the the pride all the Eurasian pride was still in her to like you know uphold the Eurasian identity she was like hello I, I can't believe that you're accusing me of Indian I am actually Eurasian you're right but like he didn't hear that he just said Indians are the worst yeah, yeah, yeah and I'm yeah, like that's his problem yeah yeah, yeah yeah that's 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 kind of his thing and then like yeah. did it end there that's it uh, well uh, Tara apologised yeah Tara so, apologised on the comment section or did they apologise on their page or what they released a statement oh. mm. they released a statement but yeah I, I think Tara you, you guys should really double down on this <laughs> right when they made a statement mm. I'm like okay there, there goes the uh, end of like, that like separate yourself from all the other apps right yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? right because yeah. I, I also think at the end of the day racist people needs jobs yeah I need work too race, race, I think uh, racist people need to work also what? yeah yeah that's because you racist doesn't, doesn't mean you, you don't need to eat yeah, yeah. right Still. they just won't eat like the Malay or Indian food <laughs> yeah yeah no, <laughs> they, no, no, they yeah. would eat Malay or Indian food if they were you know that race, yeah, yeah, right? yeah, because they are also I'm racist. About this uncle, uncle, about this uncle, uncle. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. but they were, he will eat Western food if Chinese no. cook, uh, uh, if the, he will eat the kopitiam. Would do you think it'd be fucked up if he after did that, mm. pak, and then go and eat prata because he oh. loves Indian food, yeah, but he just don't want them as customers. Is it? But he wants to be a customer yeah, of them to the Indian uh, people, right. but then he doesn't want the Indian people to hop inside his taxi, yeah. with small children, yeah, with yeah. children that's like one, three, two. One, yeah. Under one three five, yeah, right, yeah. 
Yeah. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. So that's 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 the biggest thing that's happened. Yeah. That, was, <laughs> that, was, uh, that was massive. But it, I had this like, okay, not pride. Uh, it wasn't mm. pride. But like you watch the video, like, but proud. Hey, <laughs> like, kind of cool that it still exists. Okay. I kind of like the fact that they snap. Like, I like like when Chinese uncles snap. <laughs> no, because you know, like, 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 when they that, snap, that it's that like, like, You know that moment was like, fuck, I, st- I knew you were still out there. Yeah. Like, something like right. this, I knew you were still out there. Right. Because like, they kind of kept it in for a while, the racist. Right. Like, you, mm. didn't, you didn't hear about it. Right. And then yeah, you yeah, come yeah. out, was like, I knew you were still around. Yeah, I mean, they right. had course, annual uh, meetings. Yeah. You know, they would have annual meetings yeah, yeah, and yeah, stuff, yeah, yeah. right? At the Tara headquarters. Get out, bro. No, la. And then we're not accusing Tara of racism. Of course. Of course. Misinformation podcast, right? Jackie's just being an ass. Of course. Uh, I use the app. So you use the app? Because it's the cheapest one. Like. Yeah. Go to his account one? and charge him yeah. all. Like. Usually. Oh, then you don't go to those like, uh, you know those... CDG Zig. You know, I, 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 sometimes. No, go on the, uh, the Telegram. Like it's not really... Oh, yeah, I won't I won't use that. Groups. Why? Uh? Because that is unverified. Yeah, you have to talk to them personally and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. Right. And then like they... Actually, they use that to like find chicks, right? That's, that's just what they No, that's like. A, like a lot of the creepy stories were like from tele... Yeah. Drivers, uh. Yeah. Because yeah. you have direct immediately, you get like, to message that person directly. Right? Yeah, it's called Tele Hitch. Yeah, well, okay. it's just a it's just a channel on Telegram that people join, like, Basically, right, right, right. Yeah, right. and then people will just post like, "I'm going here," or "I need a ride to here," and then they will like PM you uh, privately, like, "Okay, where do you?" Yeah, so I and mean, how much, money, price. how much money you do you do you get from that? Like, how much cheaper do you do you? No, you, I think pretty like especially you no. Know, this is popular, especially with like people who go clubs and stuff. Right. Then mm-hmm. grab will be like thirty five, forty dollars. Yeah. Right. right, Or or even like going to school or going to work in the morning. Ah, right, like if you try to yeah. find people in your neighborhood that you can that go like ride share together to work mm. or to school. Mm. So what's yeah. the solution? Do you think we this 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 uncle needs to go for like a cost, like a sensitivity nah. cost? No, like, I don't think. I think just leave him alone. Yeah, the sensitivity cost, and then the, it will the, not do the le- anything, long. The lecturer's Indian, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like just him and the lecturer. Yeah, it would not. It, it wouldn't change his mind. I yeah. think you don't right. Like I think the only thing that could really change his mind is if one day his life is in danger. Oh no! And you know then what? like a uh, Indian man come and save him, then maybe he would look at them in a different light because. Uh. Other than that, his his mindset is so ingrained mm. the way it came out. That no, but maybe he needs to listen from somebody bigger than him. So okay. make him right. like watch the Lee Kuan Yew documentary. Ah, about like multiracialism and shit. Like right. Maybe he right. will listen to so, an authoritarian that, like Chinese guy. That's where right. that's where you absorb multiculturalism and multiracialism is from a Lee Kuan Yew documentary. In that's, his own that's words, that's how you felt it. Yeah. In yeah. his own words. Okay, okay. In he, his own words. Yeah, he is a founder of this multiculturalism. Multi, multiracialism. Yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. It worked. Don't you think so? It, Bro, like he, the it's way it's working right, right now. Like one of the yeah. first few speeches of the doc was when he like shaded Malaysia like fuck. Okay. Yeah. It's like. So sad that we couldn't get multiracialism in that country or something like that. <laughs> no, like yo, no, no, like, no, 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 no. Did he say it? Are that you was, sure he bro, said it with a side the, eye? Bro, I, fuck, I can feel the side eye. Bro, the <laughs> fucked up thing was one, one, one part where he was like, um, you know, uh, we we have achieved uh, economic success, mm. uh, and I think seventy uh, percent of of votes for the PAP uh, is 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 great. However, there are thirty percent of you uh, call them non-voters. protest votes. So yeah, so those are protest votes, right? Uh, uh. And it's very sad because although everybody is very happy with uh, Singapore's success, there's some of them that still want to be treated special. <laughs> <laughs> Who, wa- who wants to keep their special treatments oh or whatever? My God. I was like, Damn. We know who you're talking about. We know who you um, I was like, yo, I felt that one. He right. pretty much he, what, what he wanted to say was, uh, you want special treatment? Uh, all I have to say is, um, no. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like he you could feel he wanted to do those jokes where he like, okay, you know, I'm the prime minister, let's of course. Keep it uh, there was yeah. one where he was like being interviewed by this English uh, journalist or something. Uh. And the English journalist just asked him one question. I forgot what the question was, and his answer was. You see the problem with Western journalists, right? Yeah. His, his opening answer was that. Yeah, I think I saw one clip where he, he said something about uh, whether I beat my wife. Oh, I don't oh. So, like, the, the, journalist asked, the journalist asked something about democracy. Like, do you think Singapore can mm. do better with the, the democracy? And then Lee Kuan Yew's answer was like, that's mm. like asking me whether I beat my wife. <laughs> And I will never beat oh, no, my like, wife. Yeah, he said, it's like asking me when I beat my wife. Wait, wait. When I never beat my wife. <laughs> Vietnam is less than okay. It's now being bombed at the level uh, that bombing was carried. Where are we going with this? Okay, hold on, hold on. This is the clip. You believe bombing is controlled. Let's go. It's like asking me whether I stop eating my wife. <laughs> I'd never beat my wife. <laughs> 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 no, no, well, um, uh, from the from the journalist is like, 
Well, um, I don't, I don't know. That's not the question, I, I, sir. Just, I no. didn't, I didn't like. I get it, like you know what I mean, like. But, but <laughs> this, I, this... I didn't say anything about beating wives. Yeah, I mean, like it weren't all hits, like He had some. Yeah, he had some duds. Yes, of some. course, <laughs> But they're not going to show that in his in his own words documentary. Of course, yeah. lah. Right. Then yeah. we saw one of his speeches where it was. Uh, we were watching it, and then this guy like 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 Lee had like a fiery speech. Like at some point, where everybody was like on the top. It was like it was the peak of the speech, and everybody's like, all right. And then like he didn't know how to end it. Right. You know, he didn't have a closer. Oh, I remember. So he just continued, and you. Can see him like, I man, I'm looking for a closer, you know. Like, oh no, I remember, I remember, I remember. Yeah, he, he, yeah, he uh, spoke something like, uh, we're like orange oil or something. They're trying to squeeze the juice out of us as a fruit. Ah. Uh, if we keep, uh, if we were to stay with Malaysia, they will just squeeze us, but we, we are built with better material, like we're a bit better than that. Right. We are like durians, <laughs> right? You can't squeeze us, something like that. And at the end, he's just like, you know, we're durians inside, it's good meat, it's high in protein. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, yo, just cut the speech. <laughs> you, 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 well you, you did well. Yeah. Yeah. Just say thank you. The durian, you, you ended it. Yeah. Fucking standing. Oh, yeah. got the big. Like, drop the mic like, already. OG, durian is great. Like, yeah. just, just say durian. It's fine. It's like, yeah. yeah. People get high it. in protein. Like, okay, you lost, you lost it, bro. <laughs> it's not high in protein, though, durian. Is it? Like, I don't know. He it said could be. Word. It could be. The first <coughs> word that comes to your mind, because we are Singaporeans, uh, I guess it would apply for Malaysians also. When you say durian, the first word that comes to your mind is hiti. All the time. Right? Durian is is heaty, right? right? Don't you think about that whenever you eat durians? No la, no. You don't. Then yeah, what if you, you eat durian, durian? I just drink coke or, or smelly ah. Well, no, I, I think durian delicious. Yeah, it's like tasty. It's like mm. yeah, so. You, you never, you never had your parents tell you before that durian is heaty. heaty? They do, mm. but they say a lot of things are heaty. It's not just durian, right? In general, right. yeah, any food is heaty except for ice cream. Ice cream is cooling. Mm, okay, right? okay, or like desserts, okay. Uh, right? Yeah, the okay. longanberry drink all that. Shit, so yeah, full of protein lah. So yeah, that's. <laughs> That's the, that's 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 what's happening. On I think there. Stephen Cha ate durian for a whole week huh? on Talking Point. <laughs> no, but oh, the huh? thing is, they just eat like one bite and then like. They no, he, he he had no, to he, eat because he commits to because the test the, yeah, the topic because yeah. the test for that episode is yeah. that a lot of people will say that durian is healthy. Mm. Like durian it's fans will defend durian by saying like it's actually a healthy thing. So he won. Yeah. Like let's see how healthy it is. I'm gonna yeah. eat it for a week and then. I, I didn't finish the episode. But you didn't finish it? What is it about? It's about durians? Durian, yeah. It's like about how, durians being how? a national fruit? No, no. Being, being healthy. Whether it's healthy or not to be Yeah, consumed. that's the talking point. It's I can't are, believe are that we're actually... healthy. I can't believe that we're actually on this topic because I actually got talking a point? DM. Fucking hell. Oh, from yeah. Stephen Chia? No, like a weird fucking Chai. DM. Bro, oh, no. okay, this is by Andy Henderson 8. Why do you... Why do you, do you, do you do that? Just read the message. You didn't have to You know why? Because it starts with wave, wave, wave. Bro, do a podcast on why durian is Singapore national fruit, please. I swear to God, it's right here. I swear to God, it's right here. Okay. And well, then we landed on this. Yeah. Just because I, when I read that, I was just like... So oh, this episode I... is for him? No, yeah. no, no. I'm, I'm just, when I so read these that, are the top uh, 10 reasons why <laughs> durian <laughs> is a national, national food. food. No, yeah. wait, listen, listen. So when I read that, I thought, I thought to myself, I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to fucking do a podcast. Like, what, 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 what a stupid, what a stupid... Request right. What a dumb request. But you now you why heard would that. I, why would I do some something like that? We have so many things to talk about yeah. that are deeper, that are more intellectual, yeah. you know, and that are funnier yeah. than entertain the fact that durian is a national fruit. Yeah. And now here we are. Yeah. yeah. So why and should now it be a national fruit? Now, yeah, now but now that you heard Stephen Chai has done it on CNA, I guess it's yeah, it's a topic worth. Yeah, at least an episode of talk. It's a talking point. Yeah, it's a okay. talking point. So durian, durian <laughs> is a national fruit. Why? Because high in protein. Why? Yeah, of course it's high in protein. First okay, of all, okay. It right. represents Singapore. Okay. Because when you say it, yes, <laughs> you have it, to you it, know listen to it, it. It inspired the design of the Esplanade. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Which that that that's where uh, next year's show is going to be at. If you guys want to mm-hmm, wonder. Mm-hmm. Uh, what we we need ten reasons ah. Uh. Yeah, ten uh, yeah. How does Jen how do this, man? Okay, so he listen. has writers. <laughs> <laughs> well, we we write. We write. We yeah. can do this, guys. We can do this, guys. Okay. What's the uh, what's number four? Uh, 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 delicious. Could be that. It's it's uh it's very useful, right? Okay. Like all parts of the fruit can be used, uh, even yes. the shell. Yeah, right. What can you use the shell for? The shell can be used to wash hand. Yeah. Yes. Uh, you can also use it as armor. Mm. Remember last time, like on Channel Five, they always have. Like you wear it as your knee, as your knee guard. Yeah, that's your. That's a, like they always do that on Channel Five last time. Mister Kiasu, yeah, yeah Mister Kiasu. Yeah, I can use it as a weapon. weapon. Yeah, right. You can use it as a weapon. Also, yeah. so is that and six already? Really? I heard that. Uh, yeah. Fandi Ahmad <laughs> learned uh, how to play football. Yeah. By starting with a durian. You know what? You know what? <laughs> fuck it. You know what? Fuck it. Joseph Schooling. Joseph yeah. Schooling uh, yeah. learned how to swim by attaching durians to himself and floating. Right. That's uh, his first. That's his first. Right. Yeah. Yeah. First yeah, few yeah, lessons. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I and that helped him to float better. 
Yeah, yeah, the, yeah that the, helped yeah. him to. Yeah, it did, it did. Yeah. It and, did, then, it did. and then, and then, uh, post um, swim, yeah, the meat full of protein. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, we can, we can, we can, we can, we can do this. Can that's do why, this. Yeah. that's why all of the part of the fruit is useful, uh-huh. especially uh-huh. for athletes. <laughs> I heard yeah. durian can also stop uncles from being racist. Uh, I heard because yes. if you like eat smelly yeah, but then you put the durian in the car, uh, you covers. smell the durian, it uh, covers yeah, 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 yeah. any kind of of yeah. racism that happens. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Be- or uh. they will just be too distracted by eating. You, mm-hmm. like, I think that's one way people can bond actually like if you don't like a, a person of another, another race yeah. share a durian with them and oh. you will bond instantly that's true over how creamy or how smelly creamy, or yeah. whatever it is Whether, if you like bitter one or like sweet one yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. durian yeah. is a yeah I think inter international ties between uh, Singapore and Malaysia can also be solved by durian for sure right you won't say like whose durian is better because yeah. we all know durian come from there yeah so yeah. Yeah, you yeah, know we order I mean? from there one, one. yeah, yeah order, order from yeah. there so that's yeah. like yeah. something that we have in common uh, as Singapore the, the shell of the fruit that's green, yeah. right? And, yeah, and Malays ha- love green, right? So that's that's. I feel yeah. I feel like Kilian was onto something. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. this is definitely actually we can think of a lot of reasons why of Singapore yeah. is a is a is a it's, national fruit. Um, durian was first implemented, uh, and on, at the same year where uh, uh streaming or uh, PSLE was uh, impl- implemented also. Im- uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> they, they implemented durian. Remember yeah. that day. <laughs> <laughs> They were yeah, like, remember they when they came they on the were. news and they yeah. were like durian yeah they were like today we are implementing yeah no initially it wasn't like uh, uh it wasn't normal technical normal care yeah, it yeah, was yeah. like no. d24 <laughs> 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 and how you get it is they spin the wheel right? yeah, 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 yeah. They spin yeah. The wheel. yeah and then the That's flappy true. thing was a durian That's skin true. <laughs> That's true. yeah bro yeah uh durian was only legalized in 1965 when we achieved independence yeah uh, yeah before yeah. this it was illegal before this it was very illegal because it illegal. was under the british rule so uh, yeah, 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 yeah and yeah, the yeah. british didn't want british didn't want durian, durian. Yeah, yeah, yeah they thought it was poison uh, <laughs> dumbass. but we uh. fought for legalization of durian, of durian. Yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah it stopped the racial riots durian Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. they were like running the the two races were running and then like this uncle like yeah three for ten dollar and then yeah. they all stop set all set at one table stopped. together <laughs> to have those durians yeah and like you can pass to... me that one then yeah, like, yeah. friendship <laughs> you know <laughs> stupid. <laughs> yeah. During the courtesy <laughs> campaign, mm, mm, all right. During yeah. the courtesy campaign, durian was used to make sure. You had good manners. Yeah, and the, yeah. the original mascot of yeah. the courtesy campaign mm-hmm. was uh, Charlie the Durian, <laughs> right? And he would go out and beat people <laughs> that were not courteous. No, they would hug people. He would ah, hug yeah, yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But he hurt, but he hurt <laughs> them. He hurt them, he hurt them and then he got fired and that's when <laughs> Singer came what, in. Yeah. <laughs> right? Okay, right. okay, finally. Yeah. Caning. Ah. Okay. First... It wasn't it, it wasn't caning, uh, You just uh, had but, to uh, yeah, no, it wasn't. You just had to sit, sit on, on the durian. durian. Oh. Yeah. 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 If you were caught with a crime in Singapore, like vandalizing, you didn't yeah. get caned. What yeah. they wanted, what they wanted the American boy to do, what's his name? Michael My, Michael White Boy. Michael White Boy? Yeah, okay, what, they, him, what yeah. they wanted that, that, that white uh, uh uh that white boy from from America during yeah. the Clinton era yeah. when yeah. he was uh vandalizing. They wanted him to sit on the No, durian. they said they said uh the, the the American government was like, please don't cane him. Mm. And then Singapore said, okay. We let him sit on the <laughs> And nobody vandalized the gate after yeah. that. No, but also they did that for like a good three months, I remember. And then after a while, they were like, this is a waste of good durian. <laughs> ah, true. They right. ate the durian still after the boys sit. Yeah, right. They still, they still ate. I didn't know yeah. that. Right. For some reason, it's better. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So those are the reasons. Yeah. <laughs> that's why it's the but national That's at least 20 fruit. reasons that's right there why, yeah. why reasons. durian is a national What's this fruit? guy's name again? <laughs> Number <laughs> what? Eight. What? Henderson. Eight. Henderson. Andy Henderson. I never thought Andy I was going to. Andy Henderson. Was, Andy yeah. Henderson. Eight from Liverpool fan. Why? Oh. Right? It must be like like Henderson is a Liverpool player. Lah, right? Okay. He okay, just left. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Because okay. <laughs> yeah. the, the problem is look Malay. So. <laughs> I mean, a lot of Malays like Liverpool, actually. Yeah, la, yeah. yeah it's a very predominantly... Nah. A lot of Malays like football, don't they? I heard. Yeah. Pff, wait, hold on. Did you? Yeah. Are you serious? That a lot of Malays play football? What? Oh, like that? What? I heard, yeah. Like, no. they, like they play Is guitar. It? Is it? Then they play football. Those, those are the no, two things that they play. Nah. They play. No, they play football. And then Is when it? the she's soccer light turn off, then they play guitar. Ah, yeah. yeah. That's what I heard. And right, also I heard that right. If uh, you play football well enough, you get selected to play in the national team. Mm. The first training mm. actually is a basic Malay class. Because <laughs> <laughs> you got to learn how to communicate yeah, with yeah, the yeah, team. Yeah, yeah. And the first word you learn is actually, saya nak makan durian. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually the first uh, Malay first word sentence. a lot of Chinese boys learn is uh, kosong. Kosong. Because like, you want, you want them to pass you the ball. 
Like, oh, hey, Mark, like, what's wrong? I'm, I'm, I'm free. Oh, you're yeah, uh, free. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. Open. Exactly. I'm open. I'm yeah, open. exactly. So, yeah. that's what I heard, lah. Like, the, the National Football Association of Singapore. What's the first Malay sound uh. that you learn in football? Eh. Uh, okay. uh, I Oh, no, 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 no. Isn't that, that how you call for the ball? Isn't that how no you call no. signal? That one is like when you're ball. on the bus on the way to the stadium, you see girl. Oh. That's, yeah, right. like you have to learn different. Football different. Mm. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. So, wow. Actually, durian affected our lives a lot. A lot, right? Of course, know, dude. We didn't know. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When was the last time uh, you had durian? Now it's durian Fucking season. years, bro. Like, huh? The last time I had durian was like two years ago. Bro. Really? I never had You're not Singaporean, bro. What? Oh, shit. Do you yeah. think I've lost my Singaporean? Yeah, no wonder. Does the boya count? No. Tempoya is actually fermented durian, durian fermented durian cooked uh, it's ikan tempoya so yeah. it's patin, fish patin, 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 yeah, yeah. patin masa tempoya so it's, it's, it's fish cooked in a uh, gravy that is uh, fermented uh, made durian. by fermented durian wow that sounds well, you don't you don't look too pleased I mean, it doesn't sound like uh. Yeah, it does. Yeah. It, it doesn't so. sound uh. It's actually fucking delicious. Man. I'm the, sure the rot, the rot actually makes it taste uh, better. The rot. Yeah. Uh. No, I, 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 I fed it to uh, Shami, our videographer, once. Yeah. And I, he you didn't, fed it, uh, you Yeah, like, no, he didn't. No, put no, it I into his mouth. No, nah, no, I put it technically. I put it in a bowl, and then I, I, I told him, I said, "Yo, this shit fire. Yo, eat it." And he didn't know there was durian in there. And then when he tasted it, he was like, "There's durian in this, uh. And then I didn't think. I think he didn't want to be rude. He was like, "It's interesting." <laughs> that means it's shit. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, speak to the mic. Uh, did, did you like it? Did you like it? Huh? It was I. Right. It was I. Right. Okay. It was I. Right. Okay. It was I. Right. But it and smelled I bad. Was was that a problem? Right. Yeah, why, why, I, I would why, think why, so. Why, you say something. It's smell kind of pungent. Yeah, of course, bro. Yeah, it's durian. Like durian is already pungent, and then yeah. now you rot it. Yeah, then you right. ferment it. Uh. <laughs> Mm. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and then like I, the Malay hand touch it like bro well that's wow. not my words that's yeah. Jackie, Jackie just, I'm Jackie. wearing green I love Malay you are people wearing, you are wearing green themed not I'm green wearing, this is a green shirt and then I, the cards used for gambling it's yeah, haram yeah. it's haram bro I wear it for you guys this eh. is I swear mm. this is every CC logo yeah, yeah, yeah. it is though it's <laughs> a PA's this logo every <laughs> association <laughs> CC but I wore this for you eh. I, I yeah, thought you guys yeah, would appreciate yeah, yeah. it of the Conor McGregor what in the king of gambler yeah, <laughs> what in the the rock in Smackdown uh, this yeah. R and D Research. It's not even king and queen, but it's R yeah, and D. What's R? R&D. Robert. <laughs> <laughs> What's D? Diana. Diana. <laughs> sure, man. Uh, okay, ladies and gentlemen, it is gentlemen? time for the segment. Uh, oh. Today, uh, Jessica is not with us. Oh. So Yay. we will be by ourselves mm-hmm. as we proceed with a segment called Misinformation. Misinformation. Wow, Jason just messaged me say, "What the fuck? It's been a year since I did Open Mic SG. I don't give a fuck, Jason. Leong. Jason, Jason okay. Leong. Shut the fuck up, uh. Wow. Okay, first story: Singapore water prices to increase by eighteen wow. percent in two phases from April first, twenty twenty four, due to rising costs. Wait, how much is water? Actually? I don't know how much water is. Who knows how, how much, much is water is? I, I know. Avian is three dollars. That's not. That's not. Yeah. That is about though. your PUB. No, it's three dollars. Like this if is you. P- the the no I know I, I'm I'm talking about the price hike is not for individual bottle of water <laughs> it's for your house pub water oh. uh, this just in Dasani is still free <laughs> yeah Dasani is still uh, undrinkable untouched <laughs> untouched okay so Singapore water prices to increase by yeah and I'm sure Tay Peng Kopi Peng is gonna be like three dollars the price the of water soon. in Singapore is set to increase by fifty cents per cubic meter oh. over the next two years what the fuck is a cubic meter man uh, uh, one ah, Okay, okay, you know, cube, one, one, one meter one, by one meter uh, by one meter lah. Yeah. Ah. That's a cube. Then I mean. why do they no, but why do they measure it by cube? We don't want to measure it by the gallons? A gallon? We don't even we use yeah. metric, bro. Yeah, we, we use a metric. We system. use the metric. No, system. No, one gallon. Uh, no, gallon isn't that is how they American. measure like, how they how they they uh buy buy water from Malaysia is like per gallon? No? I don't know. No? Okay, okay. okay. Yeah. So in light of the water shit. price increase, other cost of living concerns, the government will provide firm, additional firm. the government will provide additional financial support. So that means three hundred dollar coming your way. Two hundred. Okay? Two hundred. They, they announced already. Two hundred. They announced it. Two hundred. Two hundred per household. Per ha- no. Because it's vouchers. Per it's person. The, no, no, yeah, that is. The but there's also voucher. there's also cash. Right, right, right. Two hundred yeah, yeah. cash, and then uh, I think like there's some vouchers. CDC vouchers. Yeah, oh, CDC son, vouchers the current water price is set at two point seven four per cubic meter. Okay, wow. whatever that means. That means it's gonna be three twenty. It's gonna be three twenty yeah, per meter. Per cubic meter. Sorry, 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 sorry. But. Yeah, yeah, like you said, like the, the like tea all will. Yeah, that's this. that is my biggest concern because the tea at my house, mm. the void deck is two fifty. Eh. What the? The ice or not? Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. But the two fifty. Let me defend uh, those guys because those they, 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 that, that's my favorite kopitiam there. Uh, Jackie just is not 
um, you know, he, he's not thankful uh, as to where he stays. I'm not telling you where you stay, but yeah, your kopitiam is the best kopitiam. All right, Be, and, and you and, and no, but you don't you don't you, you don't appreciate that. The curry puff there is the best. Okay, sure. In, in, okay, in the world. Yeah, no, in the world. The world. In the world. And it's I've great. been to Barcelona. Okay, uh, yeah. whatever that yeah. means. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. And I've never been to Barcelona. I know you have never. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh -huh. And I've I've had many machis. Okay, no, I've no, I haven't many had many machis. So I've met many machis in my life. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. That much it sells the best curry puff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But we're talking about the drink. I'm pretty drink. sure the curry puff. Can. So, 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 that is related. So when you eat the curry puff, thirsty, ma. thirsty, right? You go next door and that's what, supply and demand, number one. Ah. Supply uh -huh. and demand, right? You need to drink the tea, correct? The tea 250, I understand. But that is also packed in a bubble tea cup with the machine. Uh -huh. The machine is big investment, bro. Okay. You, the packaging is solid. Inside there, and I think you can add pearl. Can add pearl? Yeah. Not anymore. Not anymore. Not anymore. You used to add pearl, right? Yeah, not Fuck anymore. Me. Okay, no, I so cannot trust a place that serves, and then they already have the drink in the fridge, in like the jug. Oh, yeah, I can't trust that. Yeah, yeah, I need yeah, to yeah. make it. You know, it. the ice lemon tea, the, 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 the what do you call this? Uh, the homemade one, they're like, you want homemade? Uh? That yeah. just came out of your fridge. What yeah, are you yeah. talking about? Yeah. Yeah, but they yeah. made before that, I guess. <laughs> yeah, but no, like, but like, I, I remember there was a point where I, there was uh, like when tea, hot tea, because I always buy hot tea, right? Yeah. Got above one dollar, yeah, and I was like concerned for the nation. <laughs> Cause like you can like uh, you know you have Do your you, change in your so so, so yeah. you okay. so so this is what happened right like you you order your tea yeah and like that's just a mama and yeah. then you and then you pay and then it was one ten yeah and I only have one dollar yeah. and then you look in the distance and like where is this and country you, going and then you and yeah. then you you show concern for yeah. this country yeah. Yeah. Like, like we lost, like we lost, the, we lost like the essence of this country. Like nobody in your head, like nobody could afford yeah. it. Yeah. This is yeah. the common man's drink. Yeah. yeah, yeah, and it should be a dollar, less than a dollar, like a dollar at most. It was yeah. sixty cents during my time. It was oh. sixty cents. Mm -hmm. Mine was like I think like seventy, eighty cents. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Now it's a, how much is one one like twenty? One twenty. One twenty. Yeah. What was the, the Arab Street one? How much does it cost? Wow, oh, that, that one, one would be probably like one seventy. Because that one is like high, like that one is high level one. Yeah, that's like. Tea done at like specialized pro, level, lah. Yeah. Pro level tea, yeah. They put in way more sugar, lor. Basically, yeah, yeah. that's <laughs> how. <laughs> yeah, what, what's your secret? <laughs> <laughs> how do you make it so sweet? Oh my god, I love it, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it just attracts more Malays. Yeah. How does this happen? No, it's not my words. Uh -huh. No, no, it's no. Like, but like, I, what I have a problem with is coffee shop nowadays mm. insisting on using making the packaging nice, lah. Right. I'm not here for, for nice packaging. packaging yeah. eh. I'm it's here at a coffee shop. Why you buy the bubble tea machine? You're not selling bubble tea, what? right? Like, my drink would be 50 cents cheaper if it's right. in a fucking plastic bag. Yeah, and I rather that's how just I, hold a plastic. I just want a plastic bag. And drinking from the plastic was our thing. Right? Yeah, you exactly. Know, it's a thing that is like very... Then now they give styrofoam cup. Yeah, yeah now, I don't want no styrofoam cup. Yeah, like, and then because they, they change all these things just as a reason to make the drink more expensive because of that mm. one coffee shop. Yeah. Every coffee shop in my neighborhood does that shit now. Yeah, la, hype, ma. It's not yeah. hype. It's that it's like it's just that's the market lah. Because yeah. because right. you can add extra cost to everything, then it ultimately you make more money. Yeah. Yeah. I would say that Chinese people are to blame for this. Yeah, uh, and it's because and it's because uh, of how you guys were too excited when bubble tea came out. So when bubble tea came to Singapore, you guys were very excited, and the packaging also played a part. Right. right. So you guys loved it so much. So that image of like a cup that is packaged like that, oh, right, to you is the like, image of having to pierce the straw through. Ah. That is something it's that's really very like innately like hap joy comes from a Chinese person. Yeah, that is I, don't, yeah I don't think that's true. So, I think Chinese people drink bubble tea yeah. because they like the bubble tea. No, yeah, but no, that, it's a big no. The whole experience yeah, okay. is the experience. Yeah, of the bubble so tea. now whatever you drink, right. you yeah. want that. Sensation. You want that satisfaction. No, so I when, don't want that. That's what right. my complaints are. Yeah, but would you feel good though when you pierce that? When you pierce that, that sound is that is that sound the plug sound right is it uh. familiar to you it's familiar but it doesn't make me feel good it's just yeah. it's just a sound right? it's, yeah. it's like it's not more familiar to me than I don't know like the train doors opening yeah. you know what I mean yeah, yeah exactly uh -huh. right exactly. Like, these are just sounds yeah but then that's it's, because you are that's you not are a consciously. Thing, it's not a thing that Chinese people was actively campaigning for like make every drink a bubble tea no we didn't do no, that no they weren't but you guys <laughs> they were, they kind of did it like, like as if like you enjoyed it okay let me just say you enjoyed it too much uh, right. you enjoyed it too much to a point where the the drink sellers, they weren't selling bubble tea. Mm. But when they saw the bubble tea guys making all that money, they right. were like, maybe uh. this is how we need to package our drinks. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And then they and then they caught on and then they charge you two fifty. How much is bubble tea now? Seven dollars? Yeah, it, it goes from three to seven, eight. Right. Yeah, the large right. one is like, like seven, six, seven. Some places, right? yeah, sell a cup, a large cup for ten dollars. Wow. Wow. What's special inside that cup? Yeah, they, they, branding. They, they promise <laughs> that they use better ingredients. Some places use like fresh actually balls. fresh fruits. Okay, so question: Will you be okay buying bubble tea at that price compared to buying tea at that price uh, at two fifty? So you are okay with bubble 
I'm just asking ah. Mm. You be, are you okay with bubble tea at eight dollars compared to teh at two fifty? Packaging same. Uh, no, most only because yeah, like like there's a time and place for everything lah. <laughs> <laughs> right, like yeah. if I'm coming into the coffee shop, I'm genuinely upset. This guy. Is. <laughs> if I come into the coffee shop, I I am here for a coffee shop yeah, time. Drink, yeah, yeah. Right, like it's and, like there are bubble. Like it's you know what I mean? It's place. like if a bubble it's tea a shop, it's like, it's if a bubble place. tea shop starts selling, I don't know, fucking chai peng. You be like, what the fuck? You like everyone <laughs> has a thing that they are selling. <laughs> yeah. Why are you taking other people's thing to sell? Right. It's, it's, but then you no, want bubble tea, ma. You just take it a bit of the no. other people's thing. No. No, no, I cannot. I cannot. Yeah. I cannot. Yeah. I no, because you are a bubble tea racist in a way. You are a bubble tea racist. No, like because these are not... The fucking coffee shop drinks are not bubble tea. Right. It's traditional it's, Singaporean uh, oh, drinks. Okay, now you're going... Uh, you see, right. You're going back but Bandung to, is not bubble tea. Yeah. But if you package it as bubble tea... It's not, though. It's, it's not, Bandung. It's Bandung. It should it should be served in a tall cup can. If if, it, cup. if you put if you put pearl, it's not worth it. It's bandung with pearl. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But the moment he puts that 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 that, that wrap that seal uh-huh. that seal on top, then it becomes bubble tea. Mm, you know no. what I mean? It's that seal that determines the drink. The, yeah. The pop. The ah. That's the, the one. I, yeah. That's okay. Now I'm back on this side. Yeah, yeah. Like the, the, that that motion. The th- that's bubble tea motion. Bro. No. Yeah. Like there are. Remember. Remember when sometimes when like, we are out and then I cannot poke. Look, uh, it's not even a bubble tea, right? Like we go to a coffee shop and then yeah. they seal it. Okay. And then Yasin sure, sure, can. Sure. No, but like, sometimes they will seal it. Yeah. Okay. They seal it. Okay. And like Yasin poke with the flat straw. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right, that's so it's not stupid, a bubble tea thing. Stupid, no, la. he he could do it. Like he he said it's a mud red thing that ah. he can pierce the, the 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 fucking seal with a flat straw. Okay. And so, so that casually, pop, he was like, he said it's he a said, mud red thing. He's, that's what he said. Those were, those were his words, not mine. <laughs> but he's crazy, so we don't. I don't. But fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> so that pop is not a bubble tea thing. It's like there are drinks that are not bubble tea using that seal anyway. Right. What I'm saying is coffee yeah. shops are fucked up for doing that because wow. they won't even use your defense. Talk your shit. When you talk to a coffee shop owner or the fucking staff or whatever, you be like, what yeah. the fuck is this shit? Yeah. They'll be like, oh, this is recyclable. Ah! That's, that is their excuse. This is recyclable. But if you take the same cup, go back, they yeah. will not use it. No, la, the, is the, the, I don't know how They will not use it. The plastic is recycled. No, I don't know how you serve plastic cups. And that, that's actually, that's true. You serve me a plastic cup, you tell me recycled, but I cannot yeah. believe then you. I bring, then I bring back, then you don't want to use. Because ah. you still want to sell me at $250. What? Mm. That is their reason, but they are lying that they say that it's yeah. better for the environment. That's well, it's not, it's not getting better for you, son, because yeah. water prices are increasing by exactly. 80%. It's $3, bro. I've $3 actually, is coming out. I've actually uh, sworn off buying coffee at their coffee shop. Their coffee shop. Hey, oh. let's yeah. go. Unless I'm there. Right? Unless at, when it's Unless late at paying, night. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Unless okay. you're paying. Oh, yeah, boom. Exactly. We forgot about this one. What? Okay, next news. World War II bomb oh, in Upper yeah. Bukit Timah successfully destroyed. That was mad. Police. All right, there was a big bomb. Uh, there was a big bomb. At who, Bukit who, Timah. Who was fucking putting the sandbags and shit? Army boys. Army boys? Not yeah. you though. Why, yeah, you so why are you proud? looking what at me fuck? like you're so proud? No, like, what yeah. the hell? Because there's a policeman? Yeah. <laughs> the but war. there were a lot of policemen. Yeah, I had to. Okay, here's the thing. Did uh, they had to evacuate people from their houses around the area, right? Yeah, yes. yeah. No, but it didn't, it didn't blow up that big, though. It blew up like kind of like no, but they, they put the sandbags and stuff to oh, like, to absorb it. Impact, and uh. even then, there were some damages in the condos yeah, around. Yeah. One of the condo, like the glass panel break and shit like that, because of the shock wave. So cool. Yeah, yeah. So it was quite. It was quite interesting because like if. If you I I was on Twitter the whole day leading up to the explosion. Yeah, yeah. Right? If, no. It's like the fucking uh, Oppenheimer scene. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Where Singapore completely like, not Singapore, but like Bukit Timah stops. Like, all of them stop. Like the MRT had to stop everything. Like yeah. to not yeah. even just look, but Wait, for MRT safety. Wasn't moving. For that for the period of yeah, time when they were gonna, gonna blow it up. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So it felt like our own Oppenheimer. So this moment, was the one. Uh, this was cool. the one that they found. Uh, this is the second one that they found. The yeah. first one they found uh, under Yakim. Oh, ah, when they evacuated, uh, sorry, when they uh, were excavating uh, right. the the old Jackim Zook, uh-huh. then they found a World War Two bomb underneath. So all this while, this decades of you partying, you were actually partying on top uh, of a fucking World uh, War Two wow. bomb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fucking sick. It could yeah. have exploded at any point of time when you were just like, took yeah. one fat person to fall. Yeah, it was yeah. just like say, I say, I <laughs> shake say. it enough that the bomb reacts. No like, but I, I, I suppose you need some type of ignition yeah. for it to to, to yeah. go off, right? Yeah, that's, that's probably what they. Actually, did. I don't know how bombs work. But yeah, I, why? Yeah, what I don't I think saw, you should actually. I don't, you know, know, I don't think we. we I know how grenades good. work. Why not? Mm. Like oh yeah, that's true. We learned a that. A control on-site disposal <laughs> of the war relic was conducted by the Singapore Armed Forces. Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, explo- <laughs> explosive ordnance disposal team. So they got a bomb squad yep. in the SAF. 
And then uh, the first detonation by the SAF marked a loud blast and mm-hmm. p- pl- plumes, plumes of smoke. Mm-hmm. Plumes oh. took place at about 12.30 p.m. So they they respected uh, the Muslim prayer time. They didn't, they didn't, they didn't explode it during Zohar. Oh, fucked up if they did it during, <laughs> it, it, during yeah. the prayer time. <laughs> <bro>. <laughs> prayer time. During, bro. <laughs> okay, explode it. And then like... No, they just, they just wait for the whole mosque to go... Oh, and then bro, they explode. Oh, fucked up. It was quite what? fucked up. That yeah. would have been fucked up. Uh, that would have been so fucked. That would be such a good bit uh, for the SCF to do, but they don't. They <laughs> no, don't no, want to just like, uh. okay, we're going to explode now. Wait, 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 wait. Wait for them to get up from the sujoot. Okay, and boom. No comments. I got no comments. <laughs> no comment on that bit at all. Whatsoever. Uh, this is one thing that can't make a clip. Uh, what, I, what, I, what I heard though is that um, this is actually a promo by Don Don Donkey. They left the box. <laughs> Don't, 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 I heard, I heard, I heard like, okay. when the bomb explode, the theme song come out. Ah, down, yeah, down, right. donkey. Yeah. Then they like, new outlet at Bukit Tima. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, the fucked up thing, right? When you go to Don Don Donkey, right? The lyrics are just Don Don Donkey, Don Don Donkey. No, no, no. Have, no, have, have actual, they have actual words. Okay, sure, sure, sure. So, First of all, I'm a fan of the song. Okay, uh-huh. song's fire. Yeah. Beats dope. Okay, beats yeah. dope. Beats dope. Pretty yeah. fire. No, she you hear it 24 hours a day. She's uh, like, okay, why, why are you there 24 hours a day? Yeah, why are you doing that? Hungry. Who wants you to go there and stay there for 24 yeah. hours? Yeah, you right? can I like, you know, walking but around. But the crazy thing, sometimes if you walk around, because there's a lot of selections, right? And then sometimes you take your time to, to pick out your groceries. There's other versions of that. Eh? Like, I swear to God, there was a, there was a ballad version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dun, yeah. dun, dun, donkey. Yeah. Dun. And then there was a jazz version. Dun, 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 donkey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. But there are actual words. It's like, every time I... Like, oh, like, shit. Like she has, shit, you know the words? I I, I remember looking them up. Like, I don't remember. Like, like, you so, look up donkey lyrics. Yeah. Don Quixote. Because, yeah. I, because I heard the lyrics and I want to know what they, like, they were. In like. Japan, it's Don Quixote, right? Don Quixote. Yeah, yeah. that's the actual... Have no, you heard I, the Donald Trump version of the song? No, sing. Don, don, don. Like they just take his oh, words and then they, they remix it into a song. Yeah. They, have, a, they have now, they have a sushi belt restaurant at Don Don Donkey. In, yeah. uh, in uh, J-Cube or not J-Cube, uh, somewhere, somewhere in the West, lah, I don't know. Mm. But <laughs> I never really care about the West. Like, really care Jerome Point, one somewhere of them. in the point where it doesn't really matter. Like I'll, I'll never go there just for it. You know, like, <laughs> it's so far away. Mm. But like, it's fucking huge. Like, it's, like, Singapore is so small. We don't mm. need like, 12 different Dodo Donkey franchises. Uh. Yeah, you could, you could say the same for NTUC, mm. Cold Storage. We don't need that many, but you know, it's... No, like, I mean, we, don't need that I, many we need one of them to be everywhere to like for convenience. Yeah, I guess. yeah, right. exactly. But yeah. Donkey is kind of like, it's convenience, but also a like novelty because it's a Japanese brand. Right. So it brings yeah. in the Japanese stuff. I used to like yeah. to go there to buy the, the those uh, sweet potato small meats. Oh, no. You know, where the you potato can like, dope, what do you call it? The, the sukiyaki? No, no, no. Yakiniku meats. Yakiniku. Yeah, so you, you, you buy it. Yeah. That is uh, a good question. Oh, that is oh, any oh, oh, question. Oh, That's a good oh, question. I'm just That's thinking about the comments. The comments. Oh, <laughs> no, sometimes oh, oh. <laughs> have you ever go to like TikTok and then like every time you go, like I, I see a food reviewers page, there will always be someone like asking halal or not. Right. Yeah. And then sometimes it's the dumbest times. Right. When like Why? this person is drinking alcohol. Okay. On yeah. the video. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Halal or not? Yeah lah. Halal lah. Yeah. Like, do you know? No, but it's just a genuine I mean, yeah, question. It's just, you know, yeah, trolling. I can just reply, no, not halal. Not, not halal. so. Uh, right. No, this is alcohol. Alcohol. It's not Bodo? approved by. <laughs> oh, okay. okay. Don't wow. say like that. Lah. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. 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 Okay, I believe We're recording. Uh, We're recording. Uh, wow. Wow. <laughs> 56 minute. 56 uh, that's minutes. That's it. I'll scared. I'll scared. I'll scared. Let me get 56 minutes. Let me get 56 uh, minutes. Yeah. Bleep. Uh, mm. The A word. Uh, <laughs> speaking of halal, okay. do you all hear about the, the Sarawak Laksa Auntie in Chinatown? Which one? Oh. Like, so Colombia. someone, so, no, no, no. It's it's um Sarawak Laksa. Mm. Okay. Right? And then she was selling it and then somebody ordered it, uh-huh. asked for extra bowl. Uh-huh. Auntie said, no, I, I cannot give you extra bowl. Why? And then this lady was furious. Mm. That go online and be like, this fucking laksa shop don't want to give me extra bowl, blah, 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 blah. And then the auntie from the shop mm. replied with her pointing at the hala sign. My shop is hala. I cannot anyhow give out plates and bowls. You understand? Boom, son. Boom. Because I'm going to mix the. Yeah. Because yeah, like if I give you and then you take and then you sh- share your pork rice with your friend or what. Yeah, like, I don't anyhow do that. Yeah. yeah. And then people in the comments were like, fuck yeah. Thank you, auntie. Yeah. This auntie knows what's up because her shop is at the Muslim corner mm-hmm. of the whole hawker center. Dope. Mm. So that is Chinese her. Auntie, yeah? 
Chinese auntie. Nice one. Nice la. Yeah. La. See, not so, all of nice them are bad. Yeah. So, so that means comments... he really did achieve multiracialism. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Huh? Just exactly. except for that one Tada driver. This <laughs> one <laughs> Tada. Okay, so former President Halima Yaakob is a SAS chan- Chancellor now. Mm. SAS Chancellor. Yeah, he's a SAS Chancellor. The SUSS. S-U-S-S. Oh, no, S-U-S-S. So why were you? Why, why would you be a Chancellor for SAS? Why would you, no, 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 you do that? So that is, is no way. Yeah, that so is clearly Pochukang. Pochukang yeah, has the role yeah, already. Pochukang is a Chancellor of SAS. Yeah. Not, no. Why would I, I don't be? call it SAS. I call it SUSS. Right. When it's you say SAS, the last time I heard SAS was the documentary for Lee Kuan Yew, and it was about SARS. Ah, uh, this guy's such a fanboy. I like yeah, it. but you you never uh, follow so the uh, newsman. Uh, or... Halima Yaakob no, Halima. has been appointed. This is not former president. Why, the why, new okay. chancellor of Singapore University of Social Sciences. That's right. Bracket SAS. Okay, yeah. I'm pretty sure Sassy all Chinese. the jokes have been yeah, done about SAS. Of course. Of course. Um, but what's interesting know? about this is yeah. that this is a ceremonial role. <laughs> of course, like everything. Yeah. You, yeah. No, no, no. This is a ceremonial role. So that means like she is. Uh, she is well qualified. Well for this qualified, role. Yeah. So she's carrying forward. Like she has experience. I'm just yeah, saying, she, she has job experience. She has yeah. job experience. Yeah. Being a, 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 ceremony, a ceremonial a ceremonial figure, figure, right? figure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And right. now she is going uh, to do that. Yeah. She is a patron of the university and over forty charitable and community organizations. Mm-hmm. Uh, in the press release, what uh, is? Consider a patron of a university. Probably someone that you contribute to regularly. Uh. Okay. Patron is just some the place where you patronize, uh, right? So like technically I can be SMU patron also. So, I, I suppose. But I, yes. I think I think like it's like she probably donates uh, a lot to them every So SAS president, President Tan Tai Yong mm. welcomed hers by saying we are privileged to welcome Madam Halima Yaakob as our new chancellor. Oh, Madam already. Yeah. Wow. Madam ah, from last time. It's, it's always been Madam what? I thought uh. president. E- Madam President. Madam President. Uh, yeah. yeah. No, they take away the president. Can, uh, it, no, oh. it's Madam President. Can I have your permission to march past and march off the parade, ma'am? Okay. I honestly you watch that part? Every, time I, every time I watch that part, <laughs> it makes me want to be president. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Like, I would love to sit at that chair during NDP. The best seat. The best seat, seat for the NDP. Yeah. That is, if, if I ever do run, that would be the reason. If I ever do run. No. I want to watch the NDP from the best seat. That's why people want to be president. Anyway, they just want that that's moment. That's the biggest perk. La. Yeah, right? that's that moment, right? Yeah, that's, so, yeah, I'm working hard towards that. La. Word, word. I'll Half see you in about 50 years time, probably. If Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Bukit Panjang woman who poured pee in neighbor's shoe. Wow. She poured pee. Bukit Panjang, ah. Uh. Bukit Panjang, ah. Uh, by the way. Yeah, Bukit Panjang. They just sold a million dollar flat as well. Yeah, but How also same same area. Yeah, <laughs> same block. Same block. <laughs> <laughs> the Bukit Panjang woman who poured pee in neighbor's shoes now allegedly sprays soya sauce on laundry. Wow. This woman is uh, next level, uh. Look at it. Look at wow. this. This is your typical. Wow. Uh, not Fucking typical. Balding, la, shame, the, the victim of uh, and her family said that the victim uh, is a neighbor from hell who refused to stop harassing them. Uh, even after mediation. So the elderly woman previously caught on CCTV pouring urine into the neighbor's mm. shoes. She actually collects her urine uh, to yeah. pour on their shoes. Uh, has yeah. continued to harass her HDB eight floor neighbors. I don't know why she's doing this. But this is mm. quite common in common Singapore. In, yeah, it's like the neighbor from hell, like a lot of like complaints. Ah. Yeah. Like old people, like I think their kids don't visit them anymore, then they Right. Just then you got nothing act to out do. Out. They just act out yeah. trying to f- get attention from The family somewhere. has been living in the same house for 26 years, bro. While Noor has moved out of the family house. Uh, Noor, Noor mm. has mm. moved out of the family house. So okay. Noor is the victim. Uh, you know? Mm. She but shared that family still faces constant harassment from the same woman right. who's living alone in a unit. You're yeah. right. Exactly. You're right. Just it's one loneliness. of those hoarder amas, bro. Yeah, I loneliness. bet it's one of those hoarder ama. Yeah. 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 But it, it, I don't know. It's always... But it's always very creative. Like you <laughs> yeah. like like you know what no. I mean? Spray soy sauce, pour Sheep. urine. Like when I was a kid, mm. there was one time when I like I, I we bought some bidaman or whatever, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I got a marble in my hand, I just play, play playing with a marble. Uh, Quite late at night. So yeah. I guess they complained. They came out and be like, uh, there's a marble sound. And then I was like, oh shit, that was me. So I just kept my marble. I'm uh. like, oh, I don't know, we don't know, we don't know, we don't know. Next day, uh. she poured chicken rice, uh, chili all over our front. Why? Our front, or the front of our door. Because it was so warning, thought, like, As a yeah, warning. Mom, she was so mad, I guess. Did you ever hear, like, as your mom said, like, if you hear marble at night, that's like a ghost upstairs. It's ghost. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. it was actually Jackie the whole time. <laughs> yeah, it's Jackie. <laughs> no, it's actually, for that, I heard from my tuition teacher in secondary school, he said that he has friends who work in construction. And what they do is when they are building the flats, they leave marbles in between. Oh yeah, to level whether the the floor is no level. for because they believe apparently this guy says that when people have miscarriage or whatever, mm. the baby goes for whatever reason goes there. That is the space that they will go, and then you They'll leave the play. marble them for them to play. Oh, uh, what I heard is is actually just the pipe doing its thing. Uh, yeah, it's yeah. the pipe doing its thing. 
But this lady doesn't even stop at marbles or urine or soya sauce. She also does artwork. Whoa, yeah. what's that? Paint. Uh, yeah, this kind of graphic art lah. I don't know. Uh, she's paint belongs to Noah's father, which intend to use to paint the house. Ayo, she's like, she's like on the floor. paint your floor. Ah, uh, fuck. <laughs> wow, <laughs> yeah, annoying, sir. Not even your floors. Uh, this is fucking mm. town yo, council's yo, floor. Like hell, hellish neighbors or something. That one, uh, like the the one that the pour one. the chili sauce. Rubs. Mine is someone like because I live first floor. I live on the first floor, so like people walk their dogs, uh, right? Mm. And then like there's this one auntie who always like. Like, I don't care, but my parents, like, really annoyed with this auntie. Mm. Like, because she keeps let, um, letting her dog pee on our stairs. Oh, okay. <clears throat> like, the side, the wall part of the stairs. Mm. Yeah. And then we tell her, like, can you please not, lah? Like, mm. smelly. Mm. And then, like, mm. someone is like, your dog. Like, we oh, mostly dog. household. Because mm. it's the first floor. You she the, the dog can literally pee anywhere. Mm. But, like, they specifically chose this spot. Mm. Every time. And then, uh, every time she walk, if my dad, because uh, they will go down the lift. There's a like, lift that's direct view from the living room from my house, right? If it, she come down already, my dad would just stand. Right. Like, just looking, like, just make sure Damn. this dog doesn't pee and it's there. Right. Fucking annoying. Because once you pee one time, then there is the, dog, the dog spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That means, like, she yeah. let the dog pee there yeah. all the time. Yeah, the first then time. Then you know, used to yeah, it already. that's why. One of my uh, aunts has been complaining to me and my dad about mm. her neighbor, mm. like, so random man, um, gets them angry if she makes any sound in her house. So, like, if, if she, like, drops a plate, Mm. Blah, 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 blah. Then the guy will just start going crazy like what the fuck? How fucking early morning makes so much noise? Blah, 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 blah. Wow. Then he play music fucking loud to fuck your day up like. Bro, yeah. my my late grandfather used to live next to this uncle. He would blast techno music. Nice. He would blast no, not nice. Not nice. It's uh, right uh, next to my uncle, my my uh uncle's house also. Lah. Right. Yeah, it was right next to my uncle's house. And then this uncle just he would just blast techno music and it's the ah bing techno it's, one. It's, it's the other techno one. Hey. Yeah. Then I'm like, then, then, then I, I told my 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 uncle, I said, learn to shuffle, lah, right? Are you, <laughs> <laughs> my I was son, like, I was like are you gonna say something? I was like, we cannot, lah, we cannot, lah. we say something, he on louder. Yeah, 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 yeah on louder. And I was like, how loud can he get? You know? Mm-hmm. I said, no, we call police and everything. It just doesn't, it doesn't help. It doesn't oh, help. Yeah. It just, and it's just an old uncle, which is. Which is weird to me, like, does he play loud because he can't hear? Oh, okay, that's a good Or that's is it because he just wants to be annoying to the neighbor? I feel like it's usually the, the latter. Yeah, for I feel Singaporeans. like it's like they did it yeah. once and then got complained and then he's like, you know what, I'm just gonna, yeah. you, you call police, okay, I'm gonna uh, keep doing it. Uh. Yeah. Wow. To, because yeah. there's nothing uh. enforcement can actually do mm. when it's that kind. Of, even if you complain to your town council or whatever, there's mm, nothing yeah. they can actually do. Yeah, this, this is make passive shit. The crazy thing is like, yeah lah, he 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 wasn't he wasn't even a hoarder man. He was a very neat uncle. Uh, right. Yeah, it's just quite. He was a hoarder of sounds. Yeah, <laughs> it was just sound. All, the only thing that were like because if he was a hoarder, it's better he will absorb all the sound. Uh, right. But it didn't. Right. It was just echoing through all the walls, Damn. and it was just hardcore techno. Just. <laughs> <laughs> so there was a period uh in, uh, in my blog mm. where like for some reason I live like first on your I blog like, on my blog. Oh, I thought, thought comeshot dot blogspot dot com. No, I don't have a blog. <laughs> I'm not a writer like that. Okay. okay. Then like that always that like, uh, by the Longkang area there will be like mm. foreign workers okay. seated there for like this span of like three, four months. Uh-huh. Oh shit. Yeah, we we're always confused. Like why mm. do we sit like right <laughs> near that? No, 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 no. This is like maybe like even like 9, 10 p.m. Like work over already. Because mm. okay. also my area nearby is dorms, right? right. You know, like yeah. near near the foreign worker dorms. We were so confused. Like, why are they always saying and then like we were like kind of scared also because like uh, it's a house everything shit like that. Yeah. yeah we were waiting wait, like, wait, why, why would you be scared like, what, 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 what was what, yeah. what, what, what were you afraid of it's not even afraid no, la. it's, it's just it... trepidation okay, okay trepidation no, 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 but, but why this is no it's yeah. giving very tada uncle vibes yeah. this is why why what? because they're the worst right if they <gasps> sit there huh? no it's just you're so, why are you sat like outside of my house like that's just the thing like, like why are you sit there? oh like right outside yeah right oh, outside okay okay, okay, no, no, okay. What we've, I see how they were raised after like a month two months like different groups sometimes okay I we figured out, I know what I realized when I was like going through like Wi Fi. Okay. There's an unprotected Wi Fi in ah. one of the houses. Oh. So I think one of them found out and then told like, <laughs> like right. their door. Or whatever. Right. Then so they come, like, hey, come here. here. If you don't have data, this one got free ah, Wi Fi. Download all the Netflix show first, then go back to the dorm and watch. Something like that. Then like, oh yeah, shit, yeah. somebody like give me free Wi Fi. Wow. Okay, final story. I Oh my God. I mean, I wish we could have picked a better, like, like no, not a better story, but a okay. less. Bummy one. Okay. Okay. This, one, fun. this is a be, bummer of a story. But that's uh, up to us to surge in executions. Huh? It's up to us to <laughs> liven it up. All right. You want to liven this yeah, up? Let's do it. Let's try yeah. liven this let's up. Try. Surge in executions as Singapore clears backlog of death row dealers. 
<laughs> yeah, make that funny, man. <laughs> Let's try and make Wait, that so humorous. They yeah. had a backlog of people that are supposed to die. Yeah, and then those guys haven't died yet. And Singapore was like, you know what? We've already released two documentaries. Uh-huh. Yeah. You know? as in like so they had to clear the backlog as in they don't die they had to clear they, the die they, 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 they had to, they to, to move die. up and start killing them back faster back by the public the super rich city estate okay this is vice news okay, Fuck. So, so. they <laughs> say back by the public that's fucked up yeah it's not it's not super rich city estate is ignoring international outrage to hang more low level drug couriers from ethnic minorities what is fella seriously what's uh, his name who's the uh, writer uh, Max Daly Max oh, Daly. This is what I do from uh, Vice the News. Fuck. Yeah, Na- yeah. Nas Daly. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what, what happened to that guy? Yeah. Huh? What he got happened citizenship to Nas Daly? Huh? He got citizenship. I think he still has an office in Singapore. He's he got he, Singapore citizenship. I think so, right? Wasn't he? Lee Sin Long gave him a. I don't know. I, mean, I don't know if it's Lee Sin Long personally. See, yeah, see, yeah, I yeah. managed right. to change it from. <laughs> 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 I did it. Yes. <laughs> it doesn't look like the Singapore yeah. government has any intention on halting executions. Well, okay, no, like, like they had to clear, right? So, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Say, say. so, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Let's so, we, can, we 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 do you think they like change the different ways <laughs> of you. killing people? <laughs> no, it's always hang. It's always hang. Always hang. Uh? It's always hang. If you if it's so you think the noose was bigger to have like three to hang one. more at one, you fuck. <laughs> Just to clear the this is an administration. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, this is no, not but about, I also think if you hang three people on the same noose, uh, it won't be as effective. Uh, yeah, right. Like yeah. then, like it'd be fucked up if you hang with. They never die. Yeah, then oh. the next to you. No, because the, the no, but. The the, the 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 sentence is hang till death. If yeah. the sentence right last time is just put hanging and then you hang you and survive. then you didn't die, you survive, you're, you're done. Oh, is it? You're free, oh. yeah, yeah. It's the, so they put a hang till death. Right. So there was this, so back heard, then like people were just walking hide, out like, hide, no. hide plastic back here to hold. They up. did the fighter training when like, they trained their neck. Oh, yeah. oh. So that's what uh that's what uh, I heard from the like, old inmates. They were like last right. time the law was like hang. So there's people that were hung and then they didn't die. And right. so it was, probably yeah. was like if you survive, then like the higher being wants you to survive something like that. Because it used to be really religious based. Oh, okay, okay. Because it's like even in Christianity, eye for an eye. So whatever you do, you have to like kind of like that's right. And in Islam, there's also like certain rules. Yeah. That yeah. So if you survive, it's kind of like the, the Christian being. one he know, but then the of Islam course. one is like got certain rules. Yeah, 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 of course. <laughs> no, because Islam is very no. That one is just uh, uh, Islam one is very what say say very <laughs> complicated. Ah, okay, okay. It has okay. like certain uh F rules you have to follow. Okay, yeah, so then, yeah. then 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 uh. So I'm guessing it's kind of like if you survive the hanging. Yeah. God wants you to not right. die yet. Okay. Right. Yeah. But then now I think it's like, okay, it's only fair if you fucking like we send us to death, you have to die. La. Right. That's that's a very light note to end on, Gum. That's yeah. the, that's 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 I think we successfully Yeah, of course. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> well, what does the article yeah. say? No, I think the article just gets more depressing. I understand, bro. I understand. But let, let, let's just go to the end and see if <laughs> let's go to the end. Yeah. See. Uh have we caught up already or not? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm more concerned with the end. Did they, like, like, they search, I'm not show the camera. They search How already. Depressing is this, uh, but it's damn depressing, bro. Of course. They search already. They search already. So have they caught up yeah, yeah. If they search back, but then it's still track? behind wait, then wait, wait, what the fuck one part of the article track? got say the Malay community so let's read uh, that okay, part yeah, yeah, let's go. <laughs> the Malay the Malay community considered to be the indigenous population of Singapore mm-hmm. okay it's starting out well oh, thank you. starting out very well mm-hmm. Somebody of did. whom many are Muslim have faced a history of discrimination by anti-Muslim hate from Singapore's majority Chinese community wow wow, 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 wow. wow. I like uh-huh. This, are, this, this, this mm. guy is waiting for Pofma. He's, <laughs> he's waiting, he's waiting. He's for waiting. Pofma, yeah. No, but I don't think it applies to him because he's vice. No, Pofma can can be sent to people. It's whether they want to like follow him. Oh. It can be a Pofma warning. Yeah. Oh, and okay vice long. has an office in Singapore also. Mm. Well, uh, it's, it's very long and it's just sad. So I'm not going to fucking read it. Yeah, but right. like, No, but, but did yeah, they catch up? No, I'm yeah. really concerned. Like, About did they manage the, to yeah. get back on track? I, if they I, are back I, on track. I don't know if they, are, if they clear their lock already. I think yeah. they need, need to meet KPI. It's very Singaporean thing. Yeah, if they, if, they, if they have caught up, then I, I think okay lah. Like the, the hanging part is still very problematic. Mm. Yeah. Right? But I'm like, as the Singaporean in me. Until until we can do something. Until we can do something about that. At let's look at the Let's look at the admin issue here. At least we're on track. Let's look at the admin issue here. Yeah. Wow. I don't know, man. I and Singapore know. remains number one at <laughs> administrative work. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Singapore number one. If you stay Singapore, you are the best. Boom. You, if you stay Singapore, Singapore. you are number one in everything. You are number one in durian. <laughs> you are what? Why? Why are you not adding? You are number one in. Um, in what? In uh. Uh, 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 what, what? What is it? Safety number one. 
Targal, targal. Uh, Singapore number one. No, targal, targal is when the the, the TikTok ends. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Do, do again, do again. I watch. Okay, I will you, not. You I will watch. not participate. Because yeah. in anticipation, Singapore. Eh, no, sorry. <laughs> what do I say in anticipation? Singapore. <laughs> If you stay in Singapore, <laughs> number one is the best safety place. <laughs> yummy, yummy in my tummy. Singapore. <laughs> I, 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 I love you guys. I love. No, Shalom Akta He was the good. Ah, he was the he good. Was. What did you just send back? The Fuck, good, that's, the, that's what upsets me about the, the Singapore good, government. Bro. Now you sent Akta Khan back. He yeah. was a gem. Did they send him back or did he just want to go home? <laughs> 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 It's not like he got evacuated. Why would he go home when he said Singapore? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I wish it will come back so we can have you on. After. Yeah, yeah after. I want number have, one. Okay, okay, that's it. Okay, bye, bye. That's the end of this podcast. That guy's never gonna make it, but no, I think we should. I think we should <laughs> totally use the last one. Of course, yeah. <laughs> you gotta splice in Akta in there too, so that you can. Okay. <laughs> Scared, 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 scared. Yeah, by the way, uh, tea is now two fifty. Uh, so go buy a lot of tea because it's gonna be three dollars and you gonna yeah, be three seventy. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be three seventy. Spend the two hundred dollar wisely, okay, guys. Uh, and gonna buy shoes. but our ticket sales are still the same price. Yeah. Mm. So yeah, yeah. The, the drinks there might be more expensive, lah. Of yeah, course, yeah. <laughs> because water, you know. Yeah, Actually, no, bro. No H two is fucking safe. Water drink. Oh, yeah. Fazon is that to be blurred? Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> this is our most blurred episode yet. Yeah. <laughs> and it's on him. <laughs> it's on him. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean that. I read that somewhere. I didn't ah. mean that. It's not for me. It's not for me. Okay, okay. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. I love you. What's up, guys? This episode of the More Better Podcast is made possible by Bipti Design. Bipti Design is an interior design company that believes your home should be a reflection of your unique style and personality. Their team of experienced interior designers work closely with you to create a space that is not only stunning, homey, but it's functional. Wow. They also have an eye for detail, mm. right? Each of them, they got at least two eyes mm. and one of them is for detail, oh, right? Nice. Uh, so yeah, the, the, the eye, very good. <laughs> Yeah, it's great. Their eyes for detail, insane, yeah. right? They also have a passion for creating beautiful spaces from stylish living rooms to chic kitchens. They will transform your house mm. into a home you will love coming back to. Yes, sir. Mm. Mm-hmm. But that's not all. You thought that was all? No. Nope. You thought that was it? No, nope. no, no, it's not. With Bipti Design, your dream home is only a few steps away. Yes, sir. A few steps. They offer a wide range of services including furniture selection, color consultations, lighting solutions, and... Much more. Yeah. Wow. They have a team. Yes, wow. sir. Because you know, every good place has a good team. That's mm-hmm. right. And this team is probably the best because they are dedicated to mm. providing exceptional quality mm. and personalized service. Yes, mm. sir. Because they know every client is unique, mm-hmm. just like all three of us. All of yes, us are sir. individuals. That's yes, right. Right? But they will tailor their designs to meet your specific needs and your budget. Mm. Mm. Everybody got a different budget. Yeah, That's why you got to call Bipti Design now at 887-52611 to schedule a free consultation and let them transform your home into a space you'll be proud to show off. That's 887-52611 at Bipti Design where comfort and creativity meets functionality. functionality. Hey, hey, wait, is where? Don't you have a house that you I just did. bought? I, 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 I just got the floor plan of the house mm-hmm. today. Mm-hmm. So in five years, that house should be ready. Mm-hmm. And uh, Bipti Designs, if you uh, sponsor a few more apps, I might be able to get you guys to come and design that house in five years time yeah. <laughs> nice one nice one maybe they'll give you 50% off alright guys so. let's no, go no, no, no.